Hi there, are you thinking of buying your son or daughter a child-friendly sewing machine for Christmas? It can be the start of a wonderful new hobby for them and give them skills, friends, a sense of community for life, not to mention the enjoyment and the pride they get from the projects they make. The thing is, it can be somewhat worrying as a parent or grandparent in knowing how to choose the right kind of sewing machine for your child. There are a few machines out there that are made specifically for children and are sold by some of the big retailers, both on the high street and online. What I would like to do is give you my very honest <laughs> opinion as to which of these you should buy and why. Now, at the time of recording this, I am not a sewing machine dealer, so this is my unbiased advice based on my experience over the years of teaching children to sew. So, the makers of these kid-friendly machines are not going to like me very much because my advice would be to avoid them, pretty much like the plague. I have seen a few over the years and I think a lot of them could be potentially quite dangerous. I've seen one overheat, one that was uh, frustrating and impossible to thread because the finger guard was just in the way and one that it just didn't sew properly. They all seem to have uncontrollable foot pedals too. You see, when children start to sew, they just won't have the motor skills that we do as an adult and haven't learned to control the speed of something with um, their foot until they're in their teens when they start going go-karting. Additionally, children don't develop the fine motor skills or indeed the required concentration levels that help them use sewing machines until they're about eight or nine. Okay. I know there are always going to be exceptions to the rule and I am not a paediatrician and I'm not a scientist. What I can tell you is that from years of teaching children to sew is that when they get to the age of eight or nine, then they seem to have the mental capacity, which is generally the patience and con concentration levels and the required motor skills uh, to be able to use a sewing machine properly. However, if you've got a younger child who wants to learn to sew, please don't let me stop you helping them. I am all for young children learning to sew, learning to sew if they are willing or able. Children love sewing machines. They love to learn to sew, but as adults, we want the experience for them to be safe and fun and exciting, not frustrating and dangerous. Unfortunately, um, in my opinion, most of the purported child-friendly machines that have been brought to me by concerned parents are simply not child-friendly. And they just end up frustrating both child and parent, and that's without the more worrying safety aspect of them. And as a, a parent myself, safety is always my number one concern. Now, I am very happy to pr be proved wrong, but that has been my honest experience of them. So if we can't buy those, <laughs> what sewing machine would I recommend for a child wanting to learn to sew? I would start by looking at one, uh, looking at one of the main brands. So we've got Brother, uh, Janome, Faf, um, Singer. Also Benina are amazing, but they're probably just a bit too pricey for a child at the beginning of their sewing life. But if you, ha if you have the budget, then absolutely go for it. Whichever brand you um, you choose, you want to start looking at the entry level machines. These tend to be mechanical and will more than likely have dials to change between the stitches or big buttons if it's a, a faff machine. These are easy then for children to use and they understand those. And the foot pedals would be much more sensitive and therefore easier to control. Any entry level sewing machine will be easy and simple to use and they are great for a child to learn on. Other than Benina, which are always going to be at a higher price point than the others, you're looking at around £100 for an entry level mechanical machine. Now, that may sound like a lot, but many of the machines designed for kids can be around the, the £60 mark. So it's not really that much more. And I would rather pay for safety. If your child has been sewing for a while, perhaps on mum's or grandma's machine, and would love to have a machine on their own, then you can definitely look at the top end of the mechanic mechanical machines uh, from one of the main brands or the start of the computerized machines. 
So for the top end of the mechanicals, you're looking at around the £300 mark um, and expect to pay around £400 to £600 mark for a good computerised machines. I've taught children as young as eight <laughs> on my mid-range computerised brother machine. It seems to be the more features a machine has, the easier it is to use. And my particular machine has different speed controls too, which obviously helps with children. And kids love all the technology. However, you obviously really don't want to be spending £800 or so on a first sewing machine for a child. All I'm saying is that the computerised bits, don't, don't let that put you off because children love them. Now, with any sewing machine, um, we need to start with safety first. Never leave children alone when um, they are learning to sew. There are lots of moving parts um, and needles can go through little fingers including the big fingers come to that. We obviously always, always also use scissors and pins and other sharp implements in sewing. However, I have found that um, starting with a safety lesson and then teaching the children how to use the sewing machine, explaining all the parts and how to place their hands so that out of the way of the moving parts can go a long way to keeping them safe. If you do get your son and daughter a new sewing machine for Christmas and have no one in the family who can teach them to sew, do consider looking locally to see who offers children's sewing lessons. Kids love them and you get a couple of hours to yourself too, which is, I think, as a bonus as a parent. I hope that has helped you to make a choice. Please do let me know if you've got any questions. I know it's a big decision. I would be more than happy to help. Thanks for watching and bye for now.